Hello and welcome to the first tutorial in the Cocos 2DX C++ physics series and in this part all we're going to be doing is just looking at what is a physics engine there's going to be no code at all first of all I just want to say this series has been requested a lot and I wasn't really oh, we were going to do this but we weren't going to do this yet because we had a few other tutorials planned but due to the sheer amount of requests for this series or just general physics tutorials it wasn't generally for a series but uh, after obviously using the physics the engine built into Cocos 2DX and all the physics engines we believe that well physics deserves its own series so here it is a physics engine is a piece of computer software that provides a simulation or more accurately the approximate simulation of physics systems. Basically this means collision detection and fluid dynamics which basically is sort of water. We recommend that you only watch this series if you are already comfortable with Cocos 2DX and programming otherwise this may seem overwhelming. We've got tutorials on Cocos 2DX and programming as well and there'll be links in the description to that. Cocos 2DX supports easy integration of the Box 2D physics engine and the Chipmunk physics engine. The latest versions of Cocos 2DX, it has a physics engine built in which is built on top of Chipmunk and is very robust. We will hence be using the built-in physics engine as it is most, most likely to be the one supported and updated in the future. This series will assume you have already generated a Cocos 2DX project and implemented multi-resolution support. There will be links in the description to the tutorials that can aid you in this process if you haven't already done it or you just need a refresher. That is it for the first part. We will start coding in the next tutorial which will cover setting up the physics world just to iterate once more. Only follow this series if you are comfortable with Cocos 2DX and programming and also have created a new project with multi-resolution support. Thank you for watching and I hope you have a great day.